If you are having a break from your Pomodoro study session, these are five things you can think about doing. So, you've got five minutes, you can't get a lot done in five minutes, you are definitely not doing any more studying. Why don't you go and make a cup of tea? If you don't want a cup of tea or a cup of coffee, I'm sure somebody else does. I'm very, very sure that your mum or your dad or your brother or your sister wants a cup of tea. And even if they don't actually want a cup of tea, the fact that you've made them a cup of tea, well, well that's really nice. I'm just going to do something nice for somebody else. For your study session, you've been sitting in the same place for 25 minutes. Your back may be aching, your knees may be aching. Just go and do a bit of exercise, go and do a bit of yoga, a bit of stretching, or just run up or downstairs as many times as you can in five minutes. Do something active. Do not just sit in the same place doing something different. Get out of the chair, move around, and do something. Now, we have so much going on in our daily lives. As well as studying, there is loads of other stuff for you to be doing. You may have chores that you need to be getting on with. Five minutes is more than enough time to load a dishwasher, or tidy out your bag, or put your washing somewhere. So, five minutes, make use of it, do something mindless, do something that doesn't require a lot of thinking. Putting a load of washing in the machine and turning it on is nice, is helpful, and it's mindless. You don't have to think too much about it. And this is what you need to be looking for in your five minute break, stuff that you don't need to think too much about. A great thing you can do in your five minute break is talk to somebody. Go and find out the gossip of what's happening at mum or dad's work, or go and find out the gossip from university, or just call up your nan or granddad and see how they're doing. Talking to somebody for five minutes is lovely, it's relaxing, it's a human interaction. It'll be really, really great for you. If none of those ideas appeal and you are suffering because you've spent 25 minutes studying without your phone, then Yes, you can spend five minutes on your phone, but please just make sure it is five minutes. Don't sit down, plan for it to be five minutes, and then an hour later find that you're still having the same conversation on WhatsApp. No, don't do that. Just five minutes. So please, please, please remember, study for 25 minutes, five minute break. Your brain will thank you. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I really hope you found this video helpful. If you want to say thank you, or if you want access to my online classroom priority video requests, or to all the books I'm publishing, you can pop over to Connors or keep up to date with everything on my website. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. And if you follow me on Twitter or like me on Facebook, you'll get all the updates there. Thanks for watching guys. I really hope you found this helpful. Anything else you need, any other help you need, just let me know below.